This is a very, very sophisticated probe that shoots sound into your neck and the sound bounces back to the probe and gets turned into an image on our flat panel screens and on this, this screen that you can see and it actually resembles the way your neck looks inside. It's like we took and made an incision and looked inside so we get to see everything. So I want you to raise your chin nice and high. Good. We lay the probe on the right side of your neck and we just start to peek. This is the width of the thyroid. I measured all the way over to the windpipe. That's the width, and here is the depth of the right thyroid lobe. Take a picture, and now instead of putting the transducer across your neck, we're going up and down the neck. And this measures the length of your right thyroid lobe. And what I can tell you about your right thyroid gland is it looks very normal. The right side looks pretty good. This right here is your jugular vein. You see it move as your heart beats. This is your carotid artery. I can even show you blood flow inside those two things. There's the blood flow, which is good. And here's a normal lymph node. I'll show you what a lymph node looks like. This thing right here is a lymph node. It is normal. I'll take a, I'll measure its length, its width and its depth. And here is your nodule. Now we're getting over on the left side looking at your nodule. And, we under and now I understand why I didn't really feel it that well, because it's on the back side of the thyroid. But your nodule is big enough to where we probably ought to sample it. That means doing a little, doing a biopsy. If you'd like to, you'll be able to see the needle go into the nodule on the screen. If you don't want to look, that's totally okay too. set up to do four biopsies here. Uh, what you'll see is that after I remove the, uh, the needle from her neck, I'll come over and put uh, um, the contents of the needle onto one or two slides, and I'll quickly make a teardrop smear on each of those slides, putting one into alcohol and taking the other one over here and uh, doing a staining procedure on it with diff quick that we will then look at with our high resolution Olympus microscope. The reason we do that is to make sure that we get plenty of specimen for the cytopathologist to look at. So we do that right here so that we're not calling the patient in a week telling them that there were not enough cells on the slide for interpretation. So there you see all these little blue things here are cells. There's a little cluster, a little three or four little thyroid cells down at the bottom. This is what we call a polymorphonuclear leukocyte cell. So we've now saved the image. This slide will go to the cytopathologist for them to look at. So by doing on-site evaluation of the cytology, I don't waste any patient material. This all goes off to the cytologist just like it would have otherwise. The issue left here that's somewhat hypochoic and up against the carotid. And uh, this was not biopsy. But you see how it sparkles as I move the probe back and forth on it? You cannot get that from a single image. It's real-time imaging that makes the difference with figuring out what this is. Ah, oh, there it is. There's hey. the It's got to get slowed down. Here's the big dumb. Hey! And look at those welcome That's what yeah, we want to see. Fun. He's saying, ah, ah. Can you hit the strobe for me? He's saying, e, e, e. Look at those. He's saying, ta, 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 ta. Ta, 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 ta. So the nerve is working well on both sides. So the papillary cancer, the thyroid cancer, has not invaded the nerve. The ultrasound allowed us to see the area on the left thyroid where the cancer is. 
and we also found some lymph nodes in the center of the neck that also need to come out. The reason we did a laryngoscopy is because she had prior surgery and we always have to check to make sure that her nerve that makes the vocal cords work on the side where they did the surgery wasn't injured.